So Charles, for your grades, I think we should go every day over all uh -huh. the information we're learning so you can make sure you get a good grade for your second week learning that. Okay, yeah, oh time. hey, Arthur, is this a new kid? Yes! <laughs> yes and no. Yes, he's new to you. No, he's not new to the school. He's been here all along. Oh, I see. Nice to meet you. I'm Nate. Hi, Charles. It's funny because I've never seen you in the school before. Like, ever. Yeah, that's because he has a disease. Oh my god. I know, he's been in the hospital for months. That's awful. Yeah, he just finally got the strength to walk again. And you know, he wants to spend every minute of his time now in school so he can learn and become a better person. You're an inspiration. And that's why we should have planned that out beforehand. boring and people usually s just sit there or sit around in student council and don't do anything but I actually have some pretty good ideas yes I kind of wish you good luck in your student council campaign thank you and who exactly are you oh I'm Ben I'm also running for student council oh right you're that kid that the bully stuff into the locker nearest the bathroom right yep that's me I'm Benny. My friends call me the Menster. That is, if I had any friends. Hmm. I'm Sarah's campaign manager. I mean, she's gonna win anyway, but a good website wouldn't hurt. Arthur, how are we polling? You are 70 points ahead of Benny. Ooh. Points means percent, right? I think so. Yes. Benny, you look down. Why is that? Well, you see, it all started in the third grade. <laughs> Great. Why don't you just lock yourself in a closet? Because there's not going to be a therapist in this world that can fix all of your freaking problems. Your new nickname is Two Chains. I have such a small closet in my room, too. Why did my room have to have such a small closet? As it turns out, I am great at giving people advice. Just great. People should call me the advice giver, or the advice genie, or the advice stirrer. I've got the rest. Uh, uh, the advice maniac. So, Charles, um, today I think we should just recap some basic geography and history, okay? Ah, yes. Can I have the pointy thingy? Sure. So, let's start off with the Northern United States. During the Civil War of 1776, they were against slavery, while down here in the Southern United States, they liked slavery. Let's fast forward to, eight, to July 4th, 1812, when the wonderful President John F. Kennedy wrote the Constitution saying slavery was bad. Over here is the wonderful country of Africa and baby Africa. Up here is Europe. During World War II, it was run by Nazis. Up here, to the right, is Asia, where everyone speaks Chinese. Oh, and let's not forget the most dangerous country in the world, Austria. Okay, that was... that was horrifying. Okay. Oh my God. How did Charles not fail previous years in school? Hey, Leroy. Oh God. Okay. Hey Arthur, need any advice? Actually, I do. How do I get geeks to vote for Sarah? Sarah wants geeks to vote for her? Yeah. Oh, hmm. I know! We should invite them to a party. But they're geeks. They'll just assume it's a prank. 
Well, tell them that they'll get free action figures. But when they don't, they'll be angry. What do I do then? Figure it out yourself. I can't give you all the answers. Benny, um, what are you doing in there? Oh, I'm just following Jake's wonderful advice. 